Hi, in last tutorial, I have already explained how to create form and how to add a form data model as a submit handler. But when we try to submit, we were getting this error. So the issue here is we added submit handler, but we did not create a mapping about their form fields. So let's close this for now. Come to our form. Now, if you see here, go to our form field. Okay, let's say this is my field. Let me close this first. Okay, so field configure. All right, you will see a option here bind reference. Before that, let me show you where did we configure that submit handler. Go to form, form, add it, and here we added like submit using data model and data model to submit we chose our data model form data model all right now that that much work we have done now map your each field to a particular field of that data model so that we know which field will be submitting data to which field of form data model and then to table let me save this first previous one open you will see if binding reference choose here choose you will see that same data model which we configured and select your field of that form data model right i need to map this id author id to this field of this okay done done same way do it for others as well it's pretty straightforward this one binding this one and I'll map this to name all right save it save email open email turn and you will see a path also here right this thing author and field same way let me do it for others so we are done with the all mapping in submit handler, you can define the redirect path as well. Means once the form is submit, then which page it should go. I'm not configuring right now. Right now, it just give a message. So we are good now. So if I try to submit, let me submit this form again. So if I submit, again, still I'm getting error. So now we must see what is the problem. I'm trying to show you how you should debug it. Okay. So we have mapped we have done everything what might be the reason so let's go to the logs and check okay so if i go to log uh, you will see a thing like you will see this line right this looks a error no default write operation is configured for data model to submit means we are missing somewhere right we did not define some services or model right but if you remember in previous tutorial when i was creating the form data model i defined three services these services were and i showed you we were seeing that error means not error warning so let's go back and check that okay we will go to our model integration and our data model right still see two warnings default service missing default write missing right that means default services are missing if you use this model if you need somewhere default services those are missing these services are for testing okay so and same this error says if you see here where it gone let me show you this default write operation is not configured okay so for that what you have to do choose this add it property okay and add a like author service right and read service you will see both options read service and write service so for read let's say get okay and if you open you will see define because you are getting the data based on which field you will get the data so you will say bind to literal okay literal and the value is author id author id 
remember this is the primary key here in my field and this is there i will bind the get service using this okay or this done get is done now write service okay write service i use insert and i don't need i need to insert everything there just save this and if you see now the default services option now there at bottom no earlier it was not there just save and as soon as you save you won't see any error means warning here error were not there these are the warnings okay now we are done we have created default services you see at bottom okay now let me try to submit that again okay so now let me submit this data 15 id is 15 geeks this one date of birth this if i submit now it's a submitted you see here right a message if because i did not configure redirect page if i would have done that so it it should redirect to that page but now it's a message so that means data has been submitted now let me open let me open my workbench or my table either from the terminal or workbench and see this data has been there or not let me search for i did not open workbench let me open it right away okay leave this error go here open okay now because i'm using this table let me search this i should have my latest data what is the problem okay use database first every time you have to define which database so my database is am geeks use this right and select this all right you see the last one 15 i gave 15 name and it came so now we are able to submit data so you see here you see here i did not write even a single line of code okay but still i am able to configure it right uh i hope you understood if you have any question please do comment i intentionally show you some steps so that you can get these errors right and the default services are pretty common pretty common you can get that error very easily and you won't understand what is happening that's why i did show you intentionally how to add that default right default right service okay uh thank you if you have any question please add that